I'm really glad Keanu Reeves worked because uh, I wasn't sure that was going to work. What's that like noise? Oh, uh, that's uh, that's uh, Nazan and typing. Remember? Oh, sorry. Yeah, that was me typing. That. It, it, oh, okay. That extremely loud clattering sound. I'm gonna once we actually get started. Um, I'm only gonna be using my mouse, but I'm sorry. I. We just hear the mouse. <laughs> It's, it's okay. like a bell that just goes ding. Is it lighter and lighter until it just becomes <laughs> a white noise? <laughs> okay, she's back. That's my warm up, everybody. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Hello. Lupin. Hey, you're everybody. here. Oh, we got it. Wait, Lupin. Lupin. Hi, Lupin. Hey. Yes. <laughs> Fire the confetti poppers, everybody. Has everybody seen that episode of Spongebob where they finally go on land and like they're just puppets? I just, that's what I feel like right now. <laughs> Isn't this amazing, Patrick? Okay, I am it's going incredible. to... Yeah. All right, so I'm going to... favorite episode of Spongebob, to be honest. You've never seen Spongebob? No, I was saying that's my favorite episode. Oh, yeah. I think my favorite episode is still the first one, is the... Uh, is Help the, Wanted? Uh, yeah, it, no, but it's no. Maybe the second one is it's just the the tape, the educational higher tape. Oh, uh, yeah, that's I think season two or season three. Yeah, because that's that's actually my favorite one. It's also the one I've seen the least and tried to watch the most as a kid. Oh wow. Yeah. Oh, so my parents hated SpongeBob because they're lame. My yeah, parents my parents thought like, uh, my parents thought SpongeBob would rot my brain. Who said well, they I never saw an episode? Really SpongeBob, then I guess. Oh yeah. That was fine, but I have also never seen a full episode. Only oh, clips. No. You, you should watch it. It's, it's, a, it's a funny ass show. I, I think we have our next uh, video streaming. Uh, Just SpongeBob with Nick commercials. SpongeBob with original commercials. Yeah. Oh, dude, that'd be crazy. I don't know where we're gonna find that, but that'd be crazy. You no, know, SpongeBob is what got me into voice acting because, like, I was so obsessed with the show as a kid that, like, I wanted to know everything about it, like, in up to and including, like, who the voice actors were. Mm -hmm. So I'm just like, Tom Kenny, he seems cool. I'm going, I'm going to literally like mold my life around his now. Uh. <laughs> well, I mean, he is Fethry, so what a what a life to mold around. It, yeah. it would be it, just remember, it would be unfortunate if he were to take your role and. uh on TK Day, so just be aware uh, of that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, so yes, everybody. There is a there's a video that we're referencing, and that will have to. If somebody could post that into the Kill Brill server, just for future reference. To... Oh yeah, I got it. All right, yeah. excellent. But aside from like half the other things, we're probably going to mention about how we created uh, not a cult, as to say, but a understanding of the universe through the uh, through Jim Cummings. <laughs> well, see, th I don't like that, that word, Gerald. Cult. No, but it was a fun new religion that I started. Here's the thing that I've been pondering, though. What if Tom Kenny came in and decided... Wait, 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 wait. We're not going into Tom Kenny lore. That's a subject for another day. We're here to stream. <laughs> Sorry. Tom Kenny lore will happen after the streaming. So, is that okay? What happened if the Reaper tried to challenge God? <laughs> okay. I, I'm taking control of this casting party. So... You can okay. see I'm I'm casting my screen. Can everybody see everything is like going backwards? Yeah, I'm seeing casts uh, yeah. all I the way down. I feel item. like I'm at like a museum of some sort, like with, yeah. like, with endless mirrors. I can yeah. see yeah. all the universes show. that Jim yep. Cummings can see. <laughs> <laughs> it's exactly like that Funhouse Duck comic that I just recently scanlated. Check my Tumblr. Ooh, that was good. Oh, oh self promotion, I see. Hell yeah. yeah. Never not self-promo. <laughs> oh, if we're allowed to make self-promos, follow my art blog. <laughs> oh, you know what? Should I be recording already? Uh, I mean, I'm rolling. Well, well, okay. I'd, uh, I'd recommend you go ahead and roll. It is yes. 8 o'clock where yeah. I am. All right. Here we go. Uh, and I think last time it just worked. It worked. I just pressed um, start recording. I've got the scene set up. Yeah. Okay. And everything was working. So, all right. We are rolling. Yes. Farts. Just we're ready to do our. We're ready to do our thing and make references to, to TK Day and that kind of lore, I suppose. No lore that requires footnotes. That'll be for the uh, the deluxe. That'll be for the extended uh, director's cut that's coming out later. I'm gonna need the spark notes. Subscribe to SnapTube on YouTube. 
They're, they're freaking awesome. You know something I just realized? What, this no, is, and Penny Parker. This uh, Penny H1. Parker meaning the YouTuber, not Penny Parker from Spider-Verse. She is a liar and a scoundrel, and and she um, she held hands with my wife. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> All right, so let's do introductions. Welcome everybody to today's fan casting fan recording of Quacklight, Bewitching Vampires in Duckburg. I am Nazanin. I'm gonna be running the stream tonight as a host. And uh, let's introduce the cast. <laughs> I okay. love that there's always silence, even well, though this is the second right. time we've done let's this. Let's start, I'm pointing to you. Let's go one by one. Oh God, so, it's AJ. the universe. <laughs> I am AJ the Blue Jay, this uh, Mary Band's Jim Cummings of choice. <laughs> I didn't say that. Although tonight I will be playing Donald, Gus, Goose, as well as Gladstone Gander. All right. Uh, I'm, I'm Jesse. I'm going to be playing Scrooge and Ludwig and the... Uh, yeah, I, I can't. I'm sorry. What was the guy's name at the end? Uh, Manolo Proofread. Right. Yeah. <laughs> it's the Proofread. Hi, I'm Lupin Lee, and I'm voicing Brigitte and McBridge. Uh, hi, I'm Matt Blatter, and uh, I think I'm voicing Feathery. Uh, am I still the janitor? Yep. Yeah, yeah. janitor and uh, Kildare Coot. Hi, I'm Amelia, and I will be voicing, well, I am, if AJ is, uh, what's his face, Jim Cummings, and I am Trust McNeil of this stream, yes, um, June which is fitting well. because I will be, yes, which is fitting because I will be voicing Daisy Duck, as well as Dickie Duck, and of course I will be reprising my role of Magic at a Spell yes. from Dangerous Currency, because... I will almost never turn down an opportunity to play her. Not the same Magicka from Dangerous Currency, though. Yeah, this is like a different Magicka. She didn't sleep with Negaduck. Yeah, no. <laughs> uh, and I'm, I'm doing a... a I'm just going to talk about that for a little bit longer. All right, we're good. <laughs> uh, I'm doing a couple minor roles, including Claire the Chicken, which I didn't realize I looked her up on Roads to Racers, and apparently on the show she just goes cluck, 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 and somebody else interprets everything. Had I looked that up earlier, then I could have totally passed off the, uh, <laughs> all of the responsibility. But That's anyway, fascinating. hindsight 2020. And yeah. she was also voiced by... By Rusie Taylor, God rest her soul. <gasps> oh, yes, God oh, rest her soul. Yeah. All right. <laughs> wow, Jay. Wow, Jay. He's like, Pour one eh. out for the nephews. <laughs> and I mean, <laughs> that mouse. Too. Got it. And he's, he's like, amateur. <laughs> <laughs> All right. When ready, uh, uh -huh. let's do it. Quack light. All right. Beautiful. I couldn't stop crying. Amazing. Did you see when he and she and she and she? <sighs> what a piece of trash. And to think that giant transformer robots eight was showing on the other screen. Shush, nephew. It might be trash, but I produced it. Ooh, and it's making me. I'm sorry to interrupt. Are, uh, is everybody else? Are you hearing an echo? Other people? I'm not hearing an echo. Yeah, I think um, I think JP may have been closer to the mic, but uh, okay. I don't think there's an echo quite yet. I'll, I'll pay attention for it. Thank you. My apologies, to JP. And it's making millions. That's why you invited you two and even Bridgeta. Actually, we paid for the tickets, including yours. I'll never understand why you girls like these films so much. Because they're romantic. Vampires are good-looking, charming, and sensitive. Then they listen to their girlfriends and... Uh... What were you saying? <sighs> it's from the day before yesterday. Bah. You boys will never understand. Uh, wait! I'll buy you an ice cream! If you're offering, nephew. Not you! <laughs> Boys are such a 
such clods. Why uh, can't we have an exciting vampire love affair too? Hey, if we can't live it, we can always write it. Great idea. We need inspiration. Get the chocolates. I already have a title. Quack life. Quack life. Wine date. Yes. <laughs> Oh no, did we cast a narrator? Nazanin, you're the narrator now. Oh. I, I saw this coming. I, I warned you guys that we might need a narrator. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking warned you. No, no, I, I was already prepared for this. Nazanin, you'd be the narrator. There you go. Young Dakella Splash had just arrived in the cold, rainy, foggy, snowy, misty, foggy, yes, twice, town of Duffberg. Oh, what a delightful place. Such a romantic, threatening sky. Just what I like. I'm dreaming of great adventures and handsome ducks. Ah, you're my niece, right? Oh, Uncle Scrooge, how nice to see you again. Great idea you had, coming to school here. Do you know how much workbooks, pencil cases, and rulers cost? And I only have three cubic acres of doors. Oh, you poor thing. But in my boundless generosity, I've decided to give you a present. Really? This rack, a vintage car. Wow, it looks very experienced. What's yeah, Donald wrecked it probably like 3,000 3, times. Nothing. And you should <laughs> never open it. Understood. But all of a sudden, here I am. I'm Bridget Tax, the good fairy of ducks with top hats. Yeah. What do you think? Maybe she and Scrooge fall in love and. Uh, but Br Bridget Tax has nothing to do with our story. And when is the character is superfluous? Out. <laughs> Come on, let's continue. Maybe I'm the problem. Maybe I'm too romantic. What do you think, Clara? Never gonna. Oh, go on. I'm listening. Never gonna let you down. Never gonna <laughs> but is it my fault? I want more from life, an adventure, excitement, a great love. Sometimes I look at the sky, the clouds, the traffic lights, and I wonder if someone out there loves me. Then I think, Clara, let me out. Let me out! The school is closed. The next day, in the cafeteria. Do you think I'm pining too much? Uh, pine away. Stu leaks again? Ooh. Oh, there they are. Metal Follow me, Bethriel, Gusmet, and Dicky Eye. Is it really Dicky Eye? Yeah. Like, is, that, is that the name we're going to go with? <laughs> I don't know. That's how I read it. I don't know like anything about Twilight. Also, oh, how? What's what's with the janitor's closet? Is she in there? What what happened? I think she just got locked in the bathroom. She's oh. stuck in the bathroom. This night was already super weird, but now Paul is stuck in the bathroom. I didn't see her go in the bathroom. Aha, I finally got a crazy ex girlfriend reference in there. I always have to. Yep, it's a thing with Amelia. <laughs> yeah, it's a thing. Anyway, back to the story. Mm -hmm. uh, I have to go now. I'm the introverted type. Oh? Who is that duck, really? And what does introverted mean? I have to find out. <laughs> nice. And so. Now, we will attempt an experiment using Dafter's third law. Get the bug, boys and girls. Um, hi. You're so gloomy today. Hi. <laughs> he's too beautiful to be true. Maybe he already has a girlfriend. Maybe he's mean. Maybe he sleeps in. Flannel pajamas. Ask me the test tube, please. Tell me about you. What kind of music do you like? I like Lady Quaqua. <laughs> the other test tube. 
So what do you do in your spare time? I draw little hearts in my diary and uh, you see, you're thinking about me and you can't concentrate. Why don't you accept our growing feelings for each other? I'm going to have a snack. All right, who are those two? I believe that that is a certain gander and a duck. Is that her? <laughs> did did you say her? I think it's Amelia. Is that a badger? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, that's her. <laughs> yes. One day, however. Do you think he loves me? But how much does he love me? Does he think about me? But how much does he think about me? Do it, hey. Dad. God damn it. Hey, ah, damn it. Hi, I'm an extra. It creates pointless dangers with my irresponsible behavior. Out of the way. Hey, stop. Help. Ow. Donward, you saved me and you destroyed the bike. So you must have incredible supernatural powers. Uh, actually, I just happened to be in the way and I've really hurt myself. So what should I do now? You can go. You have no more purpose in the plot. Johnward, where are you going? To drink a fruit juice. Ow. Oh. But... I said leave. It's better if you and I don't see each other anymore. What's happening to me? Why can't I stop thinking about him? I have to confide in someone. How about a ride on my bike? Get lost! Dear uncle, as I'm so confused and upset, I would like to talk to you for a few hours about my problems as a young girl struggling with her first love and all the other things like zits, writing D, X, D on my school bag, and listening to terrible music. So can I share my adolescent anxieties with you? No. Oh. <laughs> then I'll find out the secret of Donward ducking on my own. As you wish. Duckella used all of her feminine wiles. Tell me who you are. Come on. Tell me who you are. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Uh, I I'm I'm an alien from the, the planet Spurs. But yesterday you said you were a janitor. Uh, I'm an alien janitor. Okay. I'm almost certain he's hiding something from me. But why? <clears throat> Forget about me, Duckella. It's better for you. But why? Don't you understand? I'm a va- A va- Give it up. What did he really want to say? Old clothes? Pointed canines? <laughs> wild eyes? I got it! He's a voice actor. <laughs> <laughs> you know, the dollar, old, old ass clothes from this, you know, thrift shop. You He's know, a goose. Bad teeth, crazy eyes. eyes. Oh my god. Uh, that's why you always see Jim Cummings wearing that Legends Are Born in November shirt. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I've discovered your secret, Donward. Uh, really? You could have told me right away that you're vain. Oh no! Valiant, vapid, valedictorian, natural. How did vagina. such an airhead get in? <laughs> did you just say vagina? <laughs> Don't you worry, Duckella. Why, why did nobody say virgin? <laughs> That's why I'm cutting it. Because Donald Duck fucks. That's why. <laughs> Donald Duck. He's in the I special the three class. Caballeros. I know. I know what went down. <laughs> Don't worry, Duck Ella. I, Bridget Tax, will help you, and I'll marry your uncle. <sighs> oh no! This is more ridiculous than an episode of Lost Ducks. <sighs> yeah, leave your fan fiction out of this, Bridget. Uh, what I think is oh. Oh no! <laughs> I've got a dog squeaking. <laughs> Who, whose line is this? I think that's, I think that's yours. What we need here is some editing. Uh, do you know her? Uh, not really. She appears, disappears. But let's get back to us. Tell me why you can't love me. 
I... I... Ugh, fine, you asked for it. Oh, you're so impulsive. Now you'll find out the truth. Huh. Uh, um, so slow down. Ooh, Ouch, careful with my hair. Sorry. Oh, and, and low branches. Sorry. Ow, oh, and, and brambles. Sorry. Ah! <sighs> now we're alone. Did you have to go through the nettles? Ouch. I can reveal my secret. Oh. My face is glittering. Now you must have realized who I am. Wow, what moisturizer do you use? Ugh. I'm a vampire! Do I have to spell it out? Oh, I never would have guessed. Ugh. My cousins and I have been vampires for centuries. So as not to hurt people, we've adapted to drink juices and smoothies. But I can't escape my curse forever. That's why we can't be together. I might give in to my urge to bite. And I don't want to because I've fallen in love with you. Oh, but I love you too. Oh, well then. most passionate kiss in the passionate history of passionate kisses. Everything was spinning around Duck Ella. Was it love or just the usual food leak? No, it was love. Oh my god, I'm swooning. It's the best book ever written, ever written by anybody. <laughs> I'm uh, writing it. Great writers in just half a day. Now let's have Bridget Tox arrive and marry. No, things are going too well. Here we need a narrative obstacle. Dun, dun, dun. Now that you know everything, Duckilla, I want to introduce you to my family. Fethriel here is the leader of our family. Imagine, he's 243 years old. You look great. Are you a vampire too? Vampires? Where? Where? Cousin, please, we have a guest. Help! Vampires! Cousin, for the millionth time, we're the vampires! Oh, right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <sighs> and he's Gusmet, a snack vampire. What's a snack vampire? Gusmet only feeds on. Huh? Huh? The pastries are finished? No! Gus, Matt, get back here now! Maybe I should come back another time, Donward? No, it's okay. They come back eventually. <laughs> Dickie I can see the future thanks to her visions. Um, exactly. The visions are only terrestrial, and there's a lot of audio interference and no audio. But after July 10th, satellite vision should be available in this region. Oh. Now, for example, I see... I see two people with ill intentions. I see them too, cousin. You again! Come on, is that really how you greet your colleagues? <laughs> Magica and Gladstone, you know we don't want to have anything to do with you! Just because we're a bit naughty. More vampires? Where will this all end? I wonder. What a charming duck. Fancy a bite? N no, thank you. Oh, come now. We just want to have a little chat between vampire and victim. Oh. That's enough! You're not welcome here! Hmm. This isn't over. Soon we'll get what we want from you, Duck Ella. Hey, twenty dollars! <laughs> <laughs> it's a thousand dollars. I know. It's, I just couldn't pass up the DT seventeen reference. <laughs> we could have done without that. It's all this girl's fault. But clearly, they followed you and found us out. 
I didn't do anything. I think you did. Oh, come on. As if I... Everybody, one, two, three. Yes, yes it, it was, was your, your fault. fault. We'll leave town immediately. <clears throat> and you'll come with us, Duckella. With Gladstone and Magica around, it's too risky for you to stay here. What about my poor uncle? He'll be devastated for days and days. I have to say goodbye, even though it will break his heart. <sighs> Fine, but hurry! You're so sympathetic. <sighs> but Duckella can't tell her uncle anything without betraying the Duckins. Why? It's very simple. Dear uncle, I'm going out with a vampire. No, we need some drama to make them cry. You're right. It's better if we make them, if it makes them cry. But first, surprise. She's I'm, back. I'm back. Want to say goodbye to your uncle? It just takes a little brush attacks and he'll appear. What am I doing here? And why am I dressed like a groom? Well, speaking of that... Ugh. No, no, no! Delete all! <laughs> <sighs> Curses foiled again. All <laughs> mm -hmm. oh, rats. It's uh, like, um, the, the it's race like, That's like the, the third self-insert. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody's know thirsty. This, um, I thought the cloak figures were Organization 13. <laughs> Alright. My heart is full of anguish. Uncle Scrooge, I'm leaving. My adolescent torments, etc., etc. And Uncle? Ah, you again? Exactly, you silly little duck. Now we'll get what we want. You, you want to turn me into a vampire? Hardly. We want the codes. What codes? I don't... The ones for the money bin security system! Scrooge cunningly hid them in your old wreck of a car! Lipstick, pocketbook, I heart Donwood diary. Here they are! This time my plan won't fail! With Scrooge's number one dime, I'll become the most powerful millionaire vampire bitch in the world! Is there much competition? Oh well. In the meantime, I think I'll just have a little bite. Help! Donward! Just then, by sheer coincidence. <sighs> Ouch! Donward! <laughs> Let them go immediately, or there will be a war between vampires! Vamp- oh, uh, yeah, that's us, that's us. And then they fight for 72 pages. One of them hits. Hits the other, he hits another one. Then the vampires spit fire and well, we're we're still working on this part. I wish I had a straw for like that noise I want. I think that's you and Well, anyway, Johnward fights like a wild beast. A wild, <laughs> sexy beast. <laughs> Careful with the canines! And don't mess up my hair! All I need to stop you is a... What the... <laughs> Quaffer. All I need to stop you is a Quaffer spell. Ah! Split ends! And for you, some head-knocking sorcery. Ouch! Ow! Stop. Now I'll defeat you by predicting your moves. Hmm? From tomorrow, for just $528. <laughs> oh no, I'm only getting local futures. Wait, I, I have to prop I have to tune the decoder properly and Go ahead! Meanwhile, I'll Hmm. <laughs> I feel like there should have been a better transition between that line of dialogue and the next. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> well, you, you had the opportunity to make it because I, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. It's like they I just want to point this out. It's like for these <laughs> digital comics, they didn't really give much budget to the translators? I don't think they yeah. paid the translators. I, I genuinely <laughs> believe they don't. You guys are getting paid? <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Welcome to the Vampire Club. <laughs> ah, help! 
<laughs> Gus Matt, those guys stole your snacks. Not the snacks! Gus Matt has had enough! Oh! Ouch! You're free, Scrooge! Good. I have just what we need to spice up the battle. What? A garlic <laughs> pack? <pie. laughs> just a random one. <laughs> run! 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 I don't like this story. Luckily, I already have a part in the sixth Perry Copper movie. And that's all. The ending is still just a rough draft. But it'll be very romantic. So what do you think? <laughs> <laughs> what is there to laugh about, you ignoramuses? <laughs> you boys understand nothing of great literature. <laughs> that must be because it's a great pile of garbage! <laughs> Excuse me? I'm Manalo Proofread, a literary agent. I couldn't help overhearing your story about vampires. Hmm? And I thought it was brilliant. This book will be a huge success. Think of the merchandising. 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 <laughs> merchandising. Excellent. Everyone, everyone <clears throat> will want Donward and Duck Ellis slippers. How about a million dollars as an advance? Oh, oh. We accept we've already planned 20 sequels. And a spinoff with Bridge Attacks, who... Uh, how does it end? I see. So now you're interested. I think that's yours again, Amelia. Oh, that evening at a school prom, everyone was happy, or almost everyone. Why can't we be together, Donward? We love each other. <sighs> but the closer I am to you, the more I risk giving in to my vampire nature. I'm a vampire, and I want to bite! <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Ow! Oh no! Now you'll become a vampiress! But I feel fine. Then... Maybe all the juices and smoothies cured us. It's really true that fruits and vegetables are good for your health. Sure, but never try to bite me again, you lout. Wait, sweet Duckella. Ow! Help! The end. Woo! All right. We did it. We did it. Yeah. All right. I don't want to talk for a month. <laughs> That was Probably great, y'all. Lines, man, come on. I know, and I hate. I just, I just hate it. I'm sorry. I psyched myself into hating it. <laughs> so, what did we think of this story? Uh, Not the worst. Not the worst. Yeah, there, yeah. there's been, there's definitely been worse comics out there. Yep. Yeah. Like Dangerous Currency. Check my YouTube channel. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. I still don't know why Daisy was in the closet. Clara, you mean? Really should have. Oh, oh, whatever. Yeah. I really don't know who's in the closet. It must be Clara. We should let her out. Yeah, somebody get uh, Clara. Should I keep recording or? Unless, I, I mean, if you go. wanna. Yeah, we can, we can release the post stream debauchery. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, did, right. is there anybody in this stream besides.